Hi, I'm Tom Bassett, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to report on your report subscriptions and your dashboard subscriptions. To get started, let's jump into Salesforce setup and then navigate to report types. From here, I'm going to create a new custom report type, which is going to be related off of the analytic notifications object. But now I'm going to call this report report and dashboard subscriptions. I'm going to give this a description. I'm going to pop this into administrative reports and I'm going to set this to deployed. From this screen, I need to add in some related objects. So let's pop in analytic notifications thresholds. I also need to add in actions and lastly, action configurations. On the last object, I need to change the relationship to C records may or may not have related D records. From here, I'm going to save and then I'm going to edit the layout to add in the owner of the analytics notifications. So let's add fields by lookup. Select owner, and I want to add in to my report the user ID. Once I've done that, I'm going to save my report type and then navigate to the report tab to start looking into what reports or dashboards my users have subscribed to. Let's create a new report under administrative reports on report and dashboard subscriptions. From here, I'm going to add in some useful fields. So I want to know the dashboard title. I also want to know the report name, who it's running as, and the cron expression, which is the coded condition that tells the system how often to run the report. I'm also going to set the owner ID or owner user ID so that I can understand who set up the subscription. From here, I'm going to add in details of the recipients of the report and the type of attachment as well. I'm going to open up my report so it shows all analytics notifications from all time. But as this is a standard Salesforce report, you can add your own conditions here. I'm going to save this. And I'm going to pop this into public folder so that everybody can see it. Now, from my report screen, you can see some different types of information. So in this org, you can see that I've got two analytic assets that users are subscribed to, the sample dashboard and the sample report flows. To make things easier, I'm going to group by these fields. So in this case, the sample dashboard, Tom Bassett is subscribed to that. And this is the cron expression. And on this one, I've got two users, Tom Bassett, an integration user. And this is coming out of the system as an Excel file. For more inspiration on how to customize this report, check out the article on Salesforce Help. Thanks for tuning in. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and add any feedback in the comments. Thanks.